Welcome back everyone, I am Manic Mink. This is Europe Universalis 4. When we last left off, we were, uh... in a weird war where we're fighting for Sicily, even though Sicily doesn't exist anymore. And no one has any sort of ticking war score, because no one occupies Sicily, because it actually is part of Tuscany now. But sure, whatever. Makes perfect sense, right? They are, however, currently trying to force these idiots out of the war. Which is unfortunately easier said than done. Because they don't want to quit the war. They want to keep going because they need to defend their buddy Sicily, who doesn't exist. He's already been eaten by somebody else. Break these armies up, transport them over here. Zagreb is converted. Let's go Ukraine then. Uh, let's take a look. What do we need for this? Still, so Cordoba, Ifni. That's it. Just Cordoba and Ifni. So basically, I'm moving out west now. Base at, the po at this point, uh, I have to take Tunisia. Base tax, power, one base production. Let's get that one. That's a pretty good one to have for sure. want any more of this land. I just want to take sort of this bit and then keep going this way so I can get some sort of a, you know, not, well, I guess it isn't a land bridge, it's just a anything bridge, but some somehow get into Cordoba there. Okay, slowly transporting these guys over. And I'll wait until... here, then I will take their capital. Should make piecing them out a bit easier, I hope. Meanwhile, I guess here you guys take Sfax, sure. Okay, we gotta take all this land from Tunisia now that we have Corazon, that we have claims on. Okay, you, uh... 
Go Sardinia, will you give me war reparations? Yes, you will. Perfect. Keep sieging through Tunisia. Autonomy, discipline, unrest. I actually quite like absolute monarchy. I think I might go for that uh, as we. Well, in a minute. to actually get all these provinces we have claims on. You, uh, everything that I have a claim on should be zero cost. Zero cost, zero cost, zero cost. Is that it? No, I should have a claim on that one too. Yeah, give me those, and war reparations, not yet. Okay, then I can wait for a few minutes while we siege through the rest of your land. Now, really, what I should probably be doing is getting sort of a path this way through to over here, because I have to get to Ifni, and that's going to be tricky if I don't have a land bridge. Come on, 42%. 49%. Just... Give me a percentage, or... <laughs> Just give me something to go on. Okay, there, there, and there. Perfect. Okay, so you guys go here, here, and here. Mission reduce over extension. This I can do. Wow, even with claims, these are expensive. Jeez. Okay. Okay, let's go here. You. Seems like just actually having, well, I, I, yeah, I know, it's just having the army in the province helps.
And let's keep trying to... Yeah, this... I still want to change the absolute monarchy, because that extra lower unrest, as well as the extra discipline, is hugely helpful. Just kind of have to wait at this point. And then this truce will expire in 1675. Okay, no big deal. Sixty-three boats. So you go here. You go here. You, for some reason, have lost two infantry and two cavalry, two cannon. There we go. Build them back. You don't need a leader at the moment. No leader, please. Thank you. There's not really many places left to go, short of, like, attacking someone else. Poland still allied with a lot of people. Yodoro. Mm -hmm. Muscovy and Trebizond. Austria and Sicily. Yeah. Let's go with the most expensive ones first. They will contribute the most to reducing my overextension as well. somehow one short on infantry. I don't... Who made this army? Have I just not looked at it in that long that it just like, oh yeah, I just completely forgot I didn't have like a full army there? That seems unusual of me to forget that much, but... Seventeen, sixteen, seventeen, sixteen, seventeen, sixteen, seventeen. Ah, uh, not gonna risk losing that. Yeah, I'll flush out my armies to thirty there. I think would be nice. Seventeen five eight. Everybody up here. You go. 
guys can go here. More or less just administrative tasks at this point. I'm not in a hurry to go to war with anyone else. And I have some other armies here, so 16, 17, 16, 17. That should be all the armies at this point, right? Yes. Okay, and then three cannon for each of them. Three. more or less. You boats, you can be mothballed for now. I don't need to be paying for your upkeep at the moment. A fort here, please, because that will cover all of these areas as well. Where is this annoying revolt? Nowhere? Perfect. It's the kind of revolts I like. The kind of revolts that don't actually happen. Remember, Palermo is finished. Go there. Gain piety, lose administrative power. Yeah, we'll do that, because again, we're trying to convert.
and then I guess what we'll need is another one, two, three. So not that one, we'll do this one. Here. Do I not have enough for those? Do I not leave enough for them? Huh. Okay. Oh, right, we're still trying to reduce overextension, of course. I forgot. Uh, let me go Benias. Almost everybody should be at 27,000, is it right? I believe so, I believe we're looking at it. Okay, so we two cavalry. Let's go three, four, five. Five, six, seven, eight, ten, two, three, four, five. Actually, five, six, seven. And that's what we gotta do. Okay. development cost building down in uh, Constantinople because what we really need is uh, I need to boost the development of that province to get an achievement and I don't know how high I have to boost it but it gets more expensive every time we do Cavalry, cavalry then. All right, awesome. So we got This one, let's go there. All right, uh, so let's see, boats. Can I do anything more with boats? So let's go six. There we go. 
That should be able to fill out that fleet down there as well. You should be decreasing, shouldn't you? Yes, you are. Good. Uh, what we'll do, we'll wait until we finish these cores, and then I will take a break there. Uh, probably have to go to war with Persia some more next. Because uh, they are messing up my name. I need my name to be written better, and Persia is the only thing standing in my way. Austria, sure. 85% more army than Austria, that's crazy. Meanwhile, annexing Georgia is still going okay. This will finish in 1676. So 10 more years. Long time to integrate. They really changed that. Takes, uh, takes forever, it seems. Core construction is almost done. Let's grab this army, come over here, help them out. I could lose stability, that's stupid. So, conquer Kaffa. Badgers, military navies, heavy ships. Spain has 30. I think rule the seas is a pretty simple one. And build a. Uh, there we go. 10 more heavy ships, and nobody else will be higher than that. So, what we'll do, we'll stop here and we'll pick this up next time. I'm Manic Mink, this is European Universalis 4, and we'll see you later. Take care.